In my distress, I called to the Lord and he answered me. Good Saturday morning. What a powerful reality that when we are in distress, when we're walking through trial, when we need help, God answers. God has made us dependent creatures. He created us this way, people who need help. This isn't just a result of sin in the world. This is the way we were created from the very beginning. Before sin entered the world, we were created with a need for God and a need for one another. In my distress, I called to the Lord and he answered me. This is what we see in the record of creation in the book of Genesis. We need help. You and I need help to breathe. We can't even breathe on our own. God gave us that help. We need water and food. God provided that. We need community. It's not good for us to be alone. God provided that. Before sin ever entered the world, we needed help. We always need help. But then there are those particular times we find ourselves in what Psalm 120 describes as distress. Whenever we find ourselves in that situation, we call on the Lord and He will answer. You probably know what it's like to be in distress, to call out for help, and no one hears you. This morning, when I picked up my phone, I saw I had five missed calls in the night. I forgot that my ringer was on silent when I went to bed. Someone called out to me, and they got no answer. If that has happened to you, you know how frustrating or scary that can be. If I could just get a hold of them, I, I could get the help I need. But there's no answer. It's discouraging. In my distress, I called to the Lord, and He answered me. He didn't ignore me. He wasn't on silent. He answered me. God doesn't always answer us in the way we think we need, much less the way we would like, but He always answers the way that a perfect, loving, heavenly Father would answer. And that, in the end, is better than what we might like or think we need. God never ignores his children. We can approach his throne of grace at any time, any time we have a need. And we should approach his throne of grace every time that we have a need because Psalm 120 verse one is a reality. In our distress, we call to the Lord and he will answer us. So God, I pray right now for the person who's in distress that called me in the night and for my brothers and sisters in Christ who may be experiencing distress in this very moment. Father God, hear our calls to you for help. Hear our calls for wisdom. Hear our calls for strength, or for faith. Hear our calls for hope in our despair. Lord, hear our call for help when we are in physical pain. God, we call to you. We trust that you will answer. We trust that you will answer with your wisdom according to your riches and your perfect timing for our good and your glory. We praise you for this reality that we never call out to you and can't get a hold of you. We rejoice that you always have time for us and you hear our every cry. All glory be to you, Father God, the one who has all power in the universe and who hears our every cry. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. God bless you. See you tomorrow.